tech himself, Dr. Zeke Emanuel. Dr. Emanuel, thanks for joining us. Nice to be here. Uh, would you agree that the plan as it is now is in deep, serious trouble, even perhaps uh, in a death spiral? Well, Representative Ryan's plan does appear to be in a death spiral. You I have mean, the, the, current, caucus, the current Obamacare said, plan. You have the Freedom Caucus, which has said it doesn't like Ryan's plan. And you also, by the way, have every major medical organization voting against Speaker Ryan's plan. The American Medical Association came out against it. The American Hospital Association came out against it. Doctors and hospitals are against this plan. It is definitely going uh, down the because current there is medical extreme system, opposition. Though, the current medical system as it stands now. Oh, the current medical system. Look, no, Obamacare is actually doing quite well, better than anyone expected. On access, 22 million people got coverage. On costs, costs have actually moderated. I know the president... Is moderated the same as... Is, let, is, me, is that, let me finish, well, sir. Well, I know, but let, the, me finish. but let me also... Let me, let me, let us have a conversation, okay? Sir, if you want me to just say go for three minutes... Me. I'm just saying, you're, you're, making, you're saying things that are not correct, seconds. and I'd like to ask you about them individually instead of a filibuster, if we can do that. Okay, you talk about costs moderating. People have seen yes. their premiums go through the roof. Let me explain, okay? Premiums are going up. Under George Bush, his eight years, premiums went up 80%. Under President Obama, they went up 35%. In the last year, you have a jump in premiums in a few markets. I noticed you didn't mention Massachusetts or Indiana, where premiums in the exchange actually went down, or California, a huge state where premiums went up right. only 7%. I haven't mentioned any individual state. You have been cherry-picking. Would you let me finish? You have been cherry-picking your data and not giving an accurate representation to the country. It is true there are some unfortunate people. They tend to be of two groups. The very healthy who are getting a very sweet deal before because they weren't actually, they were being underwritten, and young people who were also getting a sweet deal because they're generally healthy. Older people have actually done much better under Obamacare. And when you compare, say, someone who's 55 in Obamacare compared to uh, Representative Ryan's plan, under Representative Ryan's plan, they're going to be doing substantially worse. It's estimated a household under Representative Ryan's plan with a head of a household who's 55 years and older will pay $7,500 in total health care costs more under Ryan's plan than under Obamacare. That is not cost savings. Okay. And by well, the way, well, last thing, the $350 billion that Representative Ryan wants to give in tax cuts are to people making $250,000 or more. It is actually going to devastate Medicare and devastate uh, the government's finances. It is a giveaway to the rich. A lot of people, here's a couple of things, okay. Uh, first of